is up you guys welcome back to my channel if you're new hello my name is Danielle and we're just gonna drive we're gonna try one of these drive with me videos so we are headed to the Atlanta Airport because I'm going to Indiana this weekend to visit my friend Morgan at DePaul University I'm really pumped about it that sounded like I wasn't but I'm so excited she's one of my best friends from high school the lighting's amazing right now <laughs> awesome I tweeted I was like guys like how do I do one of these drive with me videos like do I sing do I dance do I talk and you guys were like it's just like a little mix of both show some of your favorite songs talk about life so it's gonna be a ramble with Danielle car edition I suppose we're gonna stop and get gas first because the Atlanta airport's about an hour and a half from Athens I honestly love it because I love driving and like just having some me time I like straight up don't have a car tripod so this is really interesting um, my camera could fall at any moment so I'm risking it for you guys. So I got this smoothie from Arden's Garden, which is like, I'm pretty sure they have other Arden's Gardens around Georgia. I'm not positive though. And I always get the kale slam, but they were out of kale. And then I was like, oh, I'll get spinach. They're out of spinach. So I got this like super green, superfood powder thing. And I'm not gonna lie, I'm not a fan, but I'm just, I'm just doing it. I'm chugging it. Oh, no. Yep, there you are. I hope you're still alive down there. I really can't reach for my camera. Hi camera, I hope you're alive. Oh my God. Hi, we're still alive. This camera is a freaking trooper because it just fell. I'm gonna chug this because I know it's probably the only vegetable fruit intake I'll be getting this weekend. That moment when you don't have to hold the gas pump. We are actually on our way now. I always use the app Waze because it gets me there fastest. I'm gonna get there by 1.30. That's perfect, because I was trying to get there by 1.40. So we're gonna be early. Knowing me, probably not. <laughs> How they suggest getting one of these things, it just like goes into your air vent and it's great easy for driving. So we're on the road, we got 37 miles to go. I'm just going straight, so I figured why not just try this out? I'm still painfully trying to swallow this down. It's just, it's not as good as the kale slam. Mm -mm. It like actually needs vegetables. It's like, it's mango, pineapple, and super green powder. Ugh. Ugh. I am praying not to hit traffic because if you guys have ever driven anywhere near Atlanta, you know there's like seven lanes once you get closer and it's just so much traffic sometimes. So, should be interesting. A lot of you guys have been asking me what I'm up to like travel-wise this semester because <laughs> last semester I counted, I'm pretty sure, I traveled seven times, which was so fun and like I loved it, but I definitely missed out on some game days and just like bonding with my sorority, stuff like that. But like when I'm given an opportunity, I cannot say no. It is so hard and like I just, I don't want to miss out on anything. So, I don't know. So this semester I'm trying not to travel as much, but I'm definitely doing some fun travel. So obviously this weekend I'm going to Indiana to visit Morgan. Next weekend I'm in Athens and my whole family's coming up to visit me. I'm so excited. Um, my mom, dad, and brother are coming because Kappa Delta's spring parents weekend is next weekend. So it'll be really fun. We're gonna like go to a basketball game, like eat, all that fun stuff. And then the weekend after that, I'm actually going to New York City. Like, cause you guys know I love New York. I'm actually visiting my Aunt Debbie. She lives in Long Island and we've just like, she didn't come down for Christmas this year and like we're actually best friends. Like, she's like my big sister, honestly. She doesn't have kids or anything. So um, I'm kind of like her honorary daughter. Um, so we knew that sometime in the spring I want I was gonna go up and hang out with her. So since my schedule is so awesome where I have four day weekends, I wanna take advantage of them. Um, and there's nothing really going on that weekend from what I understand. So I'm flying out on Thursday night to Long Island and then we're gonna stay in the city for two nights. Um, so that'll be really exciting. I just love New York City. I, oh gosh. And then the weekend after that is my first weekend of spring break and I'm pretty sure I'm going to Gulf Shores, Alabama. Um, because that's like the freshman spring break destination here at UGA, you guys almost fell. I went back and forth on if I wanted to go or not just because like I kind of just want to like go home because Florida is like the spring break, break de destination and like where I live in specific is just so beautiful and I kind of just want to go home but then I was like none of my hometown friends will be there really because we don't have the same spring break. Um, so what I'm gonna do is go to Gulf Shores like the first half of spring break with like a few girls in my sorority and then, well not a few, like 20 of us. <laughs> and then the second half, I'm gonna fly home to be in Tampa for a little bit. This car hates me, I'm sorry, I forgot I'm in the fast lane. 
usually I'm kind of a speedy driver, but I'm filming, so I'm trying to be careful. So there you go, Jeep. Sorry, sorry, buddy. And then I'm in Athens the rest of March, and then and then the weekend of April 15th, I am going to Coachella weekend one. I'm so excited. I'm gonna pee my pants. I have dreamed of going to Coachella. I mean, who has it, honestly? But it's just definitely been a goal for mine, and I'm actually going with Dote because they're freaking awesome, and I'm going with some of my best friends. As of now, it's me, Marco Lee, Gretchen Garrity, Tasha. Like, literally so many of us are going already, and I'm so excited. I'm hoping Brooke's gonna come too, so that'll be really fun. Um, so yeah, that, that'll be really fun. And then I'm pretty sure that's it, because I, I'm not used to this. Like, literally, college ends so early. My last exam is on May 1st, which is insane to me. So I'll have such a long summer. Well, actually, I don't know, it depends. We just talked about traveling for so long, but you guys know I love to travel. Um, yeah, so that's that aspect of my life. I just realized I subconsciously switched back over to the fast lane. I guess it's just a habit of mine. I kind of want to make a whole video on like college partying and stuff, but I'm also like scared to do that because I don't really know who would watch it and I don't want to say something that's not what I truly mean, if that makes sense. Like. I don't know. Basically, I'm not like a huge partier by any means at all, really. Um, at least compared to like UJ students in general. UJ is definitely a party school. I like knew that, but I didn't realize how much of a party school it was till I like came and I was like, oh, there. Um, but at UJ, it's very common to definitely go out Thursday nights. Thursday nights are like the night, which is insane. So if you're going to UGA, Make sure to schedule no classes Friday or don't have a Friday 8 a.m. because I did that to myself and it was just not fun. I'm not gonna lie, it wasn't fun because you're up really late and then you have to wake up like in two hours. Not actually, I would go to bed latest at like three, but then like I wake up at seven for my 8 a.m. because I like, I have to have breakfast before I go to class. It's just, it's just not a good situation, okay? And then I also found out that it's a thing to go out on Tuesday nights, which was, which was very baffling for me at first. I was very just like, whoa, because in high school, we would have like little house parties on like Friday night, maybe Saturday night, like, oh, it's insane. The other thing, oh my gosh, I, I'm getting better at this and getting more used to it. But for any of you guys that are college freshmen as well, please like hear me out on this. Please agree with me or don't agree with me. Just like, let me, let me feel validated by this. Um, I'm used to high school where like a party starts at eight and you're like leaving by midnight. No, in college you go out at like 10, 11 o'clock. And then it's just, what? That was definitely very hard to get used to at first. It still is hard to get used to just because I'm so used to, like, I don't know. It was just weird. Like, I'd finish class and then I'd go eat dinner. And then I'm waiting around for, like, three hours to even start getting ready. And then I start getting ready and I'm just so tired. I don't know. I don't know. You just got to learn to rally, I guess. But, like, it's definitely been an adjustment. So, if you're a senior in high school, appreciate those 8 o'clock parties. I'm telling you. Because then parties don't even start till like 11 and it's just, it's just, it's not right. It's not right. I'm going to make a change in this world and it's just, it's just going to happen. Mm. I'm, I'm going to stop late right now. I've been really liking the song <laughs> Narcos by Migos. Um, it's so good. I think I'm about to learn a hip hop dance to it actually in my dance team. So that's really exciting. <laughs> video you guys can check that out I also did like a my favorite songs of 2017 video and like honestly half of those songs I still listen to so it could be still relevant in your life well yeah I think that's I feel like so yeah I feel like this video is pretty long right now and I've talked about a good amount of things some good some good content condensed in this video I don't know what all of that was 
But yeah, I'm gonna actually jam to some music. I actually am gonna call my dad because I told him I'd call him. And yeah, thanks for watching. If you guys like this video and you want me to film a video next time I drive a long way, like driving to the airport, um, I will. I'm actually going to pick my family up from the airport next weekend, so if you like this, maybe I'll do it again. <laughs> I hate myself. All right, I love you guys so much. Thanks so much for watching. Follow me on Instagram, Snapchat. I've been doing that lately. Facebook if you want. <laughs> Twitter, all that fun stuff. And I will talk to you. Ah, man. And I'll talk to you guys soon. <laughs> Bye, guys.